Hey Joanne, thanks for joining us here at Go Air and Go. Um, you're one of our featured adventure philanthropists and we're really excited to hear about your organization, Biladi. Will you tell us about it? Yes, of course. Biladi is an organization that is, dev that is devoted to promoting heritage uh, in Lebanon mainly, because that's where we started. Uh, it's called Biladi History and Nature because we believe that identity is mixed between history and nature. We work a lot with kids. We do school trips, we do field trips, we do educational tourism, something that doesn't exist yet in this, in this part of the world. And uh, while doing that, we try to break the uh, psychological barriers that the war has created and that parents are passing on to their children because of the trauma, trauma that uh, they lived during the war. So what we do is we take kids from one side of the country to the other side, let them discover it, see who the other is, see that it's not frightening and that they can actually enjoy the day and just spend a beautiful day on the other side of Lebanon while discovering heritage. Sounds great. So we've been working for a couple days on some strategic planning ideas um, and then you've organized a tour for me to go on, me and my friend Inji, for the next two days. Can you tell us about what a typical tour might be or where I'm going? Oh, you're going to discover half the country in two days. Yay! <laughs> so you're going to see nature, you're going to see first Ami, uh, and for, you're in Be Beirut, so you're going to cross the first mountain chain, get to the plain, discover Ami, that's the only wetland in Lebanon, go there, do some bird watching, because that's where all the passing birds will end, and then from there you'll go to do some wine tasting, because that's the plain where they'll do the wine in Yay! And then you're going to see Baalbek, that's the biggest Roman temples in the world, and from there up to Hermel, where you're gonna do some rafting in the wild river. Yay! And then to the Cedars <laughs> Mountain. The cedar is on our flag and you will see that tree. You will sleep over in Ehden. It's a small village up in the mountains that has very typical and very strong uh, cachet. And then tomorrow you will discover Tripoli, the second largest city in Lebanon and one of the most and one of the oldest cities in the world. 800 years of living history from Crusaders to Mamlou. You will discover all these vestiges before coming back to Beirut. Yay, I can't wait. That sounds awesome. So we're going to have a great time. You're doing amazing work. Beirut is definitely lucky to have you. I can't wait for you to expand and continue to grow. Thanks so much. Well, thanks, Go Erin Go. And coming <laughs> to Beirut it was very, very helpful for Biladi and for me. And it was really a pleasure to have you here. And such an incredible experience to just share these two days with you. Absolutely. Thanks so much. Thanks. Bye. Bye.